hello everyone welcome back to my channel if you are new to my channel this is precious decas tv today we are going to cook and trust me i make cooking very very simple and easy i welcome you both my old and new subscribers you all are wonderful and i appreciate you guys so so much Today we are going to be making afang soup using okazi and spinach. Where I stay is very very hard to find what I live. So I'm using spinach in place of what I live. As you can see, everything is already prepared. We are going to go straight into cooking. But before we do that, I would like to introduce to you what and what we have on the table. Here in the list, we have everything it requires to prepare this afang soup. Like I said before, the only difference, or should I say the slight difference is that I'll be using spinach in place of water leaf. So guys, here we have our stock fish. Here we have our shaki. We call it in my this thing we call it um towelan. And here we have my pomo. Here is the beef that we are going to use. Here we have our pepper. I'm using um this pepper, I mixed it with uh, red bell pepper, so it's not that uh, hot, not too much hot. Here we have some crayfish, we have seasoning cubes, we have our salt, we have biscuit bone. I love biscuit bone so much. We are going to be using that. And we we'll have our spinach, it's washed and ready to use. And here we have our almighty afang. I blended it with my blender. Everything is ready. So let's get started. So guys, let's go into cooking. Like I, um, I didn't mention before that we'll be using red oil, right? So the red oil goes in first. In the pot. Like we all know. Afang soup is peculiar to Calabar people and Akwaibom people. Just like the Igbos are known with Ofen Sala, Ofo Ha, Ofo Nubu. And I've lived in Calabar and have seen some of my friends make this soup, this Afang soup. And I love their method. And that's what I'm going to use today. So now I'm going to be adding the afang and the it's supposed to be what I leave but the spinach I'm going to be adding it first. I'm making this soup in a larger quantity because it's a family soup. And my family love it so much. So So allow this spinach to fry well and allow the water to dry up a bit. So guys, the spinach has entered and I will allow it to fry well and allow the water to dry up a bit before adding other ingredients. So now that it has fried a bit, I will now put my beef so it will season properly with the water leaf and allow for five minutes. So 
so guys i love my soup very very rich and i know my husband love it so too so now we are going ahead to add our crayfish salt and the seasoning cube I'll add my pomo. I'll add my biscuit bone. And I'll stay. Mm. It's looking very yummy already. And you know one thing about this soup? It takes a whole lot of oil. It takes a whole lot of oil, as in, I love it when there is too much oil on it. I will now be adding my afa, the almighty afa, bit by bit. You guys are now ready for this soup. So guys, this has been cooking for about five minutes now. So let's go ahead and stay. Hmm. And trust me when I say the soup is ready. So this soup, I'm going to serve it with pounded yam. Today. We're going to be eating it with pounded yam. So guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll be leaving the list of ingredients that I used in making this soup in the description below. Try it out at home and I know you will love it. You will definitely love it. So thank you guys. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, click on that red button below and subscribe and on the bell icon. Okay, thank you and God bless you.